Hey guys, so this is the nightmare that used to be under my kitchen sink. I actually thought I lost this footage, so it's about a year old. That's why Harvey is so tiny. I miss him being that little. But I thought it was like the perfect time now that everyone's conmiring the crap out of everything to show you what I did. So with any good cupboard clean out, it's a good idea to just take everything out and then see how much crap you really have jammed in there and then give the cupboard a really good wipe out. You'll see both of my children harassing me this entire process. So for all those mums out there that have little helpers while they're decluttering and organizing, stay strong, try and keep them involved because I have found that if my children think I actually want them there to help me, they get bored and go and find something else to entertain them. There is something really therapeutic about wiping out an empty clear cupboard and just getting into all the little nooks and crannies while there's nothing in there. I bought these glass and the spray bottles off eBay. I will see if I can find the link. We've been making our own spray cleaning products with essential oils. I love how they smell. I love how they leave the house smelling amazing. So I will um, pop some of the recipes that I've been trying out on my blog hopefully soon. And then Harvey's just helping me put back the bins that we washed out. I got these drawers and this jar from Kmart. The jar has our dishwashing tablets in it. Here's just some air freshening linen sprays that we, I've kept there. My dustpan and broom from Menu World, which is really nice, but also probably the most expensive dustpan and broom on the planet. Then in these little drawers, we just keep bin liners, sponges, disposable gloves, and a couple of essential oils in there. We have since secured these drawers to the cupboard so that they don't wobble about when we open and close the doors. Then my dishwashing gloves just hang on a bull clip and a stick-on hook on the door. And I have heaps of these grey and white sponges from Kmart. I really like them. I don't think they're very different to any other type of sponges, but I just like that they're monochrome and they go with my home. And that's the cupboard organized. I think the key to keeping a space organized is keeping it really simple and only keeping what you need. Thank you so much for watching. Feel free to subscribe if you'd like to and I will leave my details for my Instagram account down below so you can give me a follow over there too.